A Braille translator is a software program that translates a script into Braille and sends it to a Braille embosser, which produces a hard copy of the original print text. Only the script is transformed, not the language. Description For the purposes of this article, the word, inkprint means text prepared for reading by the eye, whether printed, displayed on a screen, or stored in a computer. Braille means text prepared for reading by the finger, whether brailled, displayed on an electronic device, or stored in a computer. Braille translation software or embedded hardware converts inkprint into Braille or Braille into inkprint. Usually someone has inkprint in a word processor file or at an URL and wants Braille. The Braille could be sent to a Braille embosser to produce physical Braille or to an electronic notetaker. Another circumstance is that someone has Braille in an electronic Braille notetaker that they want to produce an inkprint to be shared with someone who does not read Braille. Braille translation software is usually classified as assistive technology, since the action of the software provides Braille for a blind person. Braille translators can be run by people with or without sight. A Braille translator can run on a smartphone, personal computer, network server, or historically larger mini computers or mainframes of larger institutions. Some languages use uncontracted Braille, where each letter uses a specific Braille character. Uncontracted Braille requires manipulation of capitalization, emphasis, numbers, and punctuation. Some languages use contracted Braille, where the rules for various Braille abbreviations are quite complex. For example, in contracted English Braille, the word think five letters is rendered as three characters, th in k. The use or non-use of these contractions is related to pronunciation. For example, the th sign is used in think, but not pothole. Unless properly programmed, a computer might make a mistake that no person would make, such as using the contraction for mother in the word chemotherapy. The most difficult part of producing Braille is making the decision of when and when not to use contractions. When people make these decisions it is Braille transcription, when computers make these decisions it is Braille translation. History The first practical application of computer translation and production of Braille used mainframe computers at the American Printing House for the Blind of Louisville, Kentuck. During the 1960s, there was an MIT project to automate the production of Braille. Robert Mann wrote and supervised software for Braille translation called DOTSYS, while another group created an embossing device which became known as the MIT Braille Emboss. Eventually, MIT outsourced the software work to MITRE Corporation. The MITRE Corporation team of Robert Gilday, Jonathan Millen, Reed Gerhardt and Joseph Sullivan now president of Duxbury Systems developed DOTSYS3, the first Braille translator written in a portable programming language. DOTSYS3 was developed for the Atlanta Public Schools as a public domain program, at the first international workshop on computerized Braille production, held in Munster, Germany, March 1973. Many Braille translation projects from around the world were described, an archive of documents on the history of Braille, Braille translation, and some Braille devices is maintained by Duxbury Systems. See also Book E-book Braille e-book Perkins Brailler External links Duxbury Systems Duxbury DBT, supports over 130 languages and math Documents on automated Braille production, an historical resource Blista BrailleTech GmbH German Braille production software. Notes <laughs> <laughs>